Guten Tag, guys. We're moving forward. Um, we've mentioned a couple of times that we've had issues with our recording gear. Well, all right. In case you don't know what we're talking about, we use the 3DIO FS2 Pro to record headphones and give you guys an idea of what they would sound like without you having to buy them as far as it can possibly be done at least over YouTube and all that. But then we came across a problem. The recordings that this gear was making sounded, they just sounded way too bright and sometimes tinny. This made brighter headphones sound awful while they weren't actually so. And after some investigation, we came to the conclusion that this 2000 euro piece of kit was anything but neutral. So we decided to stop doing all recordings till we could figure it out. Luckily, as we were discussing these issues, the manufacturer, 3DIO, came back to us and what it finally came down to is they asked us to add a base shelf with a specific knee point to compensate for the equipment bias. Even that didn't sound perfect to us, so we made some changes and we can say we're finally happy with the recordings we're getting out of these. Now, these won't be perfect, so what we're also going to try to do is give you a reference recording. Something like a Sennheiser HD 600 so you can hear the equipment bias for yourself. Hopefully that will help give you guys an idea of what you can expect without having to buy the gear for yourselves. Of course, nothing beats using your ears to test the real thing, but this is an easy zero calorie substitute for that. Yes, the last couple of videos where we've been recording Bluetooth speakers have been made using this technique. And that's it guys. You can start expecting more recordings from us again. You've probably seen them in the last two Bluetooth speaker videos. Thanks for your patience. I hope you're having a lovely 2023. You've been hearing about hearing what we're hearing and we've been DHRME. Namaste.